know what it is from the office. When you said it, she blowing me kisses. 2:30, baby, won't you meet me by the beach? Early, baby, lady, you can show me things. You know what it is from the office. <laughs> Are you guys? We made it. Say hey, y'all. Hey, y'all. Uh we got everything moved in now. All of my stuff is still in boxes. My bed is on the flow. Um, what else we got? We have got nothing done but moving in. And it was a process. First of all, my daddy be telling stories. So pretty much, I'll tell you the story quickly. So there's a freight elevator basically to get all your big stuff in. And I couldn't get it booked uh, for when I was planning to move in. And I already knew that. But of course, my dad and in his special ways came up here and somebody asked him did you book it and he basically would you say tell a story by omission he, he did the same thing. He, he he smiled and grinned as they <laughs> asked that basically and so we accidentally took somebody's booking which is why no we didn't take anybody's booking we kind of because it was open at that time okay well anyways it was in the way of somebody's Booking because my dad sat there and smiled and grinned and just let them give us the freight elevator because <laughs> that's just how he is okay big scammer box but anyways um yeah what we're about to do now it's freezing outside we're about to break it's really not that cold I'm gonna stop I can't I can't say it's cold because like I'm about to see a lot harsher weather than this okay so I'm gonna be grateful for today but anyways yeah we're getting ready to go to IKEA because we still have the moving truck and we gotta move some big stuff today. So I'm gonna take you guys with me while I go get all of the big things. And yeah, y'all are kinda just gonna go throughout my first day of moving. But I'm so excited to be in Chicago. So many of you guys, oh, we pop bottles today too. They were nice enough to um, bring a bottle of Prosecco. So that was a cute little touch with my name on it. I think I showed y'all that. Yeah, I showed y'all that. Sorry, my mom handed it to me. She just want me to flick so bad, here you go. No yeah that's the move today we're gonna go do a little shopping um we're not gonna do everything today so y'all can just follow along until we get this process done i'm really not trying to finish it all in one week it's gonna take however long it takes okay because i just know myself if i decorate everything in one week i'm not gonna like something next month so we're just gonna marinate marinate in the space and figure out what i want <laughs> but all right let's go so we decided to come to Target first because we happened upon a Target on the way to get gas. By the way, my gas was like, the gas was like $5 a gallon almost. I had to pay for the Penske truck gas and my car gas. And I'm like in distress right now. Okay, moving, number one. I knew it was expensive, but I didn't know it was this expensive. It's absolutely ridiculous. I should document how much it costs, but let's see we're looking for some towels right now i really don't know if i want to go with white or if i want to go with another color like white is so you know cute and obviously nicer to look at but obviously it also stains the worst so i just don't know i just don't know you get cheap i don't know if i like the waffle ones Taylor, how do you feel about the waffle ones? I They're just they not plush. I, don't, like, I feel like they don't dry you well. I have a waffle robe though and I don't really like it. Yeah, me either. Well, that's not what you like. Yeah. So we're gonna get the threshold towels instead of the Casa Lunas because they're a little bit cheaper. These are nine and the thresholds are 12. But if those don't hold up good, I'll you know just come back and try these. I think I'll probably get soap dispensers and stuff off of Amazon. <laughs> Taylor, what do we have left on the list? Pull out your iPad. You got your whole iPad, right now. She's about her business. Who gonna run up on me? Can y'all stop playing? Oh my god. You got a whole iPad on you. Don't get my, right. my personal information. Because oh. it got my school on it. Alright. Alright, so we got towels. You can check that off. Uh, we don't have washcloths yet, but I'll probably get those from Ikea. Tissue. Yeah. So I don't really want to get like major kitchen stuff right now because I kind of want to shop online for like the major stuff. 
you just you really just don't want to buy stuff like that all out of the store and i might want a cute matching set so is this more speckled than this one mm -hmm. yeah i like i like this one it has a little more tone in it than that one does 20 mm -hmm. yeah let's do that when i have some time i definitely want to organize my spices super cute all right but they do have these here for like three dollars that you can put your little spices in and then you can put them on the little rack so i think i may do something like that but i probably won't put them on the rack because i need all the counter space i can get Y'all know I want the gold forks. Dang, these expensive. Yeah, I about to say, you want to just pick your eyes up. What about the black ones? <laughs> but I want the gold forks. They got black? You're not even. Oh, the black ones are nice. That's what we have. Why you want gold, though? What? Because your plate. Mm -hmm. <laughs> black. black. I want black and gold. Why not just go? <laughs> Why you want the black and gold? So I know I said that I wasn't going to get any decor. We just came across this just standing by itself. It's a soap pump. How cute. It's all textured with a black top. And so like my backsplash is gray. So it's dark. So this will be really cute. All I was trying to do was record both carts and this is what i get i ain't taking y'all nowhere else nowhere else y'all are very much ratchet and y'all need to stay home that's y'all that's your people <laughs> so we just got to ikea um i think they close in like an hour and a half so we don't have that much time but we're mostly looking for a ikea pack system okay because i need to put my clothes up there's not that much space so i'm gonna have to get an ikea pack system for my clothes and also obviously for like my fashion videos and stuff but we're gonna see what else is in here but i'm really not trying to get too much decor like right now because i kind of want to like look online and just really think about it you know This is what we're here for. Although I don't have a legitimate walk-in closet, so we're about to make one. Three hundred dollars. Here you can. That's all. That's not, that's not even bad for how big this thing is. Shoo. Shoo. <laughs> Which one you getting? This kind of sturdy now. What you talking about? Oh, they got this drilled to the wall. That's why. So this right here mm -hmm. and this right here. So I need the packs and then I need, well, these, these are all packs, yeah. but okay. So I need to take a picture of these. I love this one cause it has like the drawers you can't see through. And then is this a see-through drawer? Yeah. Yeah. So I have to figure out what to put there, but I know I want to put like jewelry and sunglasses. And then right here, definitely like where I can display my clothes that I'm using for the video. Oh, I didn't even know. Is this part of it too? The shelf up here? I guess you could probably put a shelf up here. And I can put stuff I don't want to see <laughs> up here. Well, you have to buy that little thing right there. This? Yeah. But I can still use a shelf without this, no? Yeah, you can still use a shelf without it. Like, I can put cute stuff in the front, and the stuff I don't want to see, I can put back, back there. I don't need yeah. this. I just need to put it in the back. All right, so we're going to take a picture of this. And then we like this other shelf. Oh, this is so cute with the lights. I wonder where I can find those. I think they have them, but you could buy them. The girl said you could buy them from here. And one day I'll have room for this too, you guys. We'll just, if it's not too cheap and breaks down, we'll just take it with us. Y'all, it is complete chaos in Ikea right now. Everybody got their kids in here. <laughs> the kids were around. Yeah, watch over. One kid, we didn't watch all this happen in like less than 60 seconds. <laughs> we didn't sit here 60 seconds. I didn't see a kid spill his drink all for the same family. Another kid 
<laughs> the other kid was getting a drink. Please look at this picture. I'm gonna insert the picture. <laughs> This is making me not want to have any kids. <laughs> like, they're doing too much. Oh my god. We're gonna do a little haul. Hold on. So, I'm gonna give you guys a little bit of a haul. You guys just saw all the packages I got in. And, well, I'm not gonna show you everything because some of it is fashion stuff, but I'll show you like a couple of things. But y'all gotta stay tuned for the fashion stuff because y'all know I do like my little collective hauls. They delivered this, I got this on Amazon. I'll link all this stuff below. I can't promise you I'll link all the Target stuff below because it's a lot. All right. Um, it's just too much just go to target okay but i'll link like the amazon stuff below oh thank you i don't have to scream oh, the fan just went down bless bless up anyways i got this little projector um it was not expensive so that was good i'm pretty much gonna watch tv on my wall or curtains when i put them up because i don't like tvs i just don't like how tvs look I'm not a fan of TVs being in my bedroom, so we're gonna go the projector route. Plus, I just really love the vibes of, of a projector. I told Taylor I'm gonna watch Euphoria just because I want to watch it on my projector. I'm scared to watch Euphoria, you guys, but I think I might make an exception on a projector. I just feel like it would be a vibe. No? Like they all be like, oh, and doing drugs and stuff on the projector. Like, a vibe. Otherwise, I think if I watch it on my computer, I'll be depressed. So that's why I haven't watched Euphoria yet. If, you, if you're somebody who doesn't like watching people be depressed and you watch Euphoria, how do you feel about it? Because I don't like watching people say it. Like, I don't like dramas because I'm not trying to, like, I'm trying to get away from my drama and my sadness. Like, I don't want to watch somebody else be sad. Does that make sense? I don't know. Everybody else seems to love it. You guys know it's killing me not to watch Euphoria because of the fashion, obviously, but... So far, I've been doing well. And Zendaya. I literally love her and I still have not hit play on that. What do we have? Oh, these are my shelves. Okay, so I'm not gonna open these right now. I'll show you guys after Edward installs them. <laughs> what? <laughs> I think one's open. I'll insert a picture of how it's supposed to look. I really wanted a black aesthetic in my bathroom with gold touches. They're just matte black. So they're gonna go in the corner basically. Ooh, I feel like you can cut yourself with this. I didn't cut myself, but it just felt sharp. This is gonna go in the corner of my bathroom, um, in the shower. So yeah, I bought um, two sets of these actually, so I can put four. It comes with two, but I bought two sets because I want to do four of them. But yeah, I just think it's gonna be really cute. I wanted something really minimal. I don't really like those big ones that just look all bulky in your shower so that's why i went with these okay. he already out here scoping all the food that's around what if you guys live in chicago comment your favorite place to eat and that would help so much because your girl likes to eat all right so the next thing i got has nothing to do with my apartment but has everything to do with this bomb content i'm about to serve you guys okay so it is a i've literally bought this before this is my second time buying it and the only reason i'm buying it again because I lost it. I lost it. So basically, it is a handheld tripod. So if you're uh, one of those embarrassed content creators, you can walk around with this tripod. And no one will know that you're walking around with a tripod. Because it literally stretches out really tall. And you can put your phone on it. It's just for a phone though. And it comes with a little Bluetooth clicker. So yeah, I bought another one because the one I had was super convenient. But I had no idea what I did with it. It was so convenient and small that I lost it. So... We bought another one and they were really affordable so it wasn't the biggest deal it works really well i like it um let's see what is that you still talking about these tacos <laughs> i'm weak all right so the fashion thing that i'll show you now is from zara because i know how it be at zara things sell out and so i have to show you now or else if you wanted it you wouldn't be able to get it i think so all right, so I ordered these jeans the other day from Zara, but I, they came in because I think they changed their sizing. It's like literally everything is so tight. 
I used to be a two and apparently now I'm a four in Zara jeans. If, if these fit. These look like they'll fit. <laughs> no, I'm not getting thick. It's, <laughs> I wish, I wish it was because I was getting thick. But I've seen other people saying that their clothes have been small when they try to do their normal size from Zara. So um, yeah, I bought these jeans. They're like wide leg jeans and they're ripped. And then they're um, raw hem. So I just thought they were really cute. So I bought these. Um, I'll try them on whenever I do a collective haul. So right now your girl is stressed. But anyways, um, this next thing I'm so excited about, but they put it in here a little ratchet though. They just threw them in here. Like I needed another pair of black pants. <laughs> you guys, if you watch my channel, you already know how I feel about platforms and black. So I'm tempted to put these on right now. Okay. You guys don't have to beg. I got you. I'll put them on right now. Okay. Everybody can stop asking me. They're going Alright. Yeah. They're comfy too. And they fit perfectly. I'm a seven and a half, but these are an eight. But I wear eight sometimes. Just cause. Not really because I need to, but they didn't have seven and a half, obviously. Mm -hmm. Um, but yeah, these fit good. They're cute. Shoes. Our toes looking kinda good to me right now. Per. This is like my third pair of boots like this in life. Maybe four. Wish I could see them in my new Hovet mirror. <laughs> Alright y'all. We're back. With the stuff that I got from Target. So update on Ikea. All I got was that mirror that you saw being set up. That's all they had in stock. So yeah, we went to Ikea and all I got was a mirror. I could not get any of my pack system. I could, but I just didn't because I was, everybody was ready to go. Everybody was stressed out. So we're going back tomorrow. So I'll vlog that, but that'll probably be in the next vlog. So like, make sure to subscribe, stay tuned and whatnot. But, um, ugh. all right. I will show you stuff I got from Target. And then as the stuff from Ikea, comes in like for my pack system and like you know my fancy looking closet or whatever all that other stuff first off i got this um Cuisin art stainless steel knife set um we actually had this at my house but it was like a lighter version but i'm happy that the wood is darker on this because i think it will look better um with my aesthetic but anyways, um, yeah, it's basically white knives set, so I thought that would be really cute. And they work really good. They cut really well, okay? I've experienced these before, and they're amazing. So, had to get this. They're a little bit of a splurge, I think, for the knife market, because I know a lot of people don't really spend too much on their knives, but it makes a difference, okay? You don't want to be sitting there going like, that's what I used to do in college. It's not fun. I like simply taking my knife through my steak and just going through easily so we had to get nice knives i was super excited to find these glasses i think these were the last ones left these little cute rounded glasses by threshold so this is what the smaller ones look like they're kind of rounded now uh, they kind of look like little wine glasses so you know i could easily just pour my wine or my you know rosé in there and you know kick back because you guys are gonna be seeing a lot of that y'all gonna be seeing a lot of like little nighttime routines and stuff like that so i'm looking forward to that you can let me know if there's any other type of routines y'all want to see but um i guess i can show you the taller glass because i haven't seen it myself and these are the taller glasses so yeah i just like that they're bigger at the bottom they're interesting i think my iced coffee and whatever i'm drinking will look aesthetically pleasing because that's the main goal here okay we like some aesthetics. I think everybody does. So, you know, it's no different over here. So, yeah, those are really cute. We also, speaking of wine, got a wine opener. Um, I didn't want to join the struggle bus anymore of hand twist wine openers. I was like, I need me one of them electric ones. So, we got an electric one. It's just like the little Houdini. 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 Houdini one so I haven't tried it yet I cannot vouch I don't know what it works like but you guys will see it you guys will see it okay so we're gonna try these threshold sheets not gonna say too much about them but they're just like the performance 
sheets and I got the off-white color but um yeah I'll let y'all know how that goes we got this toilet brush thought it was cute I have personal experience with this to uh, with, with this toilet brush buffering but um yeah so I like it so I got it again okay this right here I'm looking forward to this one so this we got a lot of white stuff for the kitchen okay this is going to go I hope you guys can see it well this is going to go on my countertop for my kitchen it's basically going to be for all of my like spoons and stuff so it's going to be on the counter in the corner looking very pretty it's marble so it's really heavy but it actually was not like a bad price i think it was like maybe 20 dollars, which is not bad for like how cute and quality this is so we actually got this from walmart um it's this little water filter so you know we're we're not gonna do water bottles we're gonna try to just drink water that's filtered and then it's also a cute little container so it's got like the black top and stuff so yeah this is basically just gonna, how i'm gonna use um water instead of like lugging up huge water bottles and stuff we'll just use like this little water filter it's called a pier all right i got some really temporary bowls these are actually the same exact bowls that i had in college i got these just for temporary and i got some matching plates as well just to eat out of until i get like my real dishware because they were super cheap um so i just needed something so instead of paper plates we just went with these very temporary very temporary but it'll do the job for now and then along with um some white little dishcloths so these are going to be for the kitchen but i do have um a, did i get washcloths oh wait is this one is this one singular singular one? Oh, I do have a couple. Never mind, y'all. All right, I'm not gonna show you my cleaning supplies, but if that's something you guys are interested in this channel, I did do a clean with me one time just because I love, I don't know, I love watching clean with me's, but I don't know how you guys would feel about that over here considering I talk about a lot of fashion, but I do do lifestyle. So I feel like maybe it could fit. So just let me know. Maybe we can do it like in a re reset ritual, a reset routine. Because that is how I like to reset. With a really, really clean bathroom. Because just the smells and stuff. So let me know. And then we can go through like the products as I'm cleaning, you know. Alright, and then I just got, we took it out of the package already. But it's this little um, extension cord. Because, you know, we need those to reach places. So this is actually the cutest extension cord I've ever seen in my life. Maybe I'm easily impressed, but this is actually a really cute extension cord. All right, and the thing that I'm most excited about, I get it from my mama, and she got it from her grandmother. We like blankets, okay? My grandma used to make me quilts. Like, she used to make everybody handmade quilts, and so I feel like we probably got that from her, liking blankets so much. But anyways, I love a blanket. I plan on getting more blankets, so don't say nothing when you see me buy another blanket. But anyways, um, this is a Casa Luna blanket. Y'all know Casa Luna is the bougie section of Target, so she was not that cheap, but it's okay. I'm gonna use it a lot, so. But yeah, it's very soft and knit. I haven't gotten to open it all the way yet, but I think it's gonna take up like my whole entire bed because it says um, full queen. And it does feel like really nice quality, so that's really good. I'm most excited to use this. I'm out of breath. boyfriend just called me uh he's back from handling some business with my dad so we're about to go get tacos because i have not eaten anything decent 
all day. Like I had IKEA food. That's not really a meal. Okay, let's go. So today was quite literally one of the most stressful days, top five stressful days. Um, I think just cause it's focused around me, which makes it stressful. I hate things focused around me. Like I don't throw myself parties or want anybody to throw me a party cause it's just stressful with things being focused on me. As a Leo, I feel like that's really weird, but I don't know. Like I like everybody to look at my outfit when I enter a room, but like, please don't focus on me for like hours on end. Does that make sense? <laughs> So yeah, like I'm so tired and we have not unpacked a single box. We only put away all the stuff we bought today. I made my bed. Um, we haven't even built the frame for my bed to go on. So you guys, it's on the floor right now. I am not going to lie to you. It's on the floor. The closet space, that's a whole different story. Like y'all don't even want to see my closet space right now. I'm going to work on it and I'm going to get somebody to come in and do some built-ins to like maximize the space. When I tell you I'm peeping out every little crevice I can put clothes at because obviously being like a fashion influencer, I have kind of a lot of clothes. I really don't have as many as I've seen some people have, but like still like more than like the average person. So it's like, I really need the Ikea pack system. I really need just maximized shelving. But yeah, we're nowhere near what this apartment is going to look like by the end. But the view makes me so happy, I'm not gonna lie. Like, I just find myself, like I keep looking at it and I'm just like, I really wanna see what it looks like when I wake up early in the morning. Cause because they said that I'll be able to see the sunrise and the sunset, I wasn't here to see the sunset. But um, I don't think I'll be waking up to see the sunrise either. But <laughs> eventually i will see it but yeah i'm just so grateful to be here if you would have told me a year ago i'd be in chicago living in a luxury high-rise apartment with a super nice view like literally everybody who comes in and sees this they're like your view is really good i don't know how mesmerizing it is on camera but in person like it's beautiful the past year and i'm like Do y'all have anybody that just blows their nose in the shower? That was my boyfriend. <laughs> I'm sorry, I look so tired. But, but um, yeah, there's gonna be more, you guys. I'm sorry if everything was like so hectic. Like I just was everywhere, okay? Like nothing was organized. I was honestly frustrated some of the day. Like we were all frustrated because we were all just so tired and everything. So <sighs> I hope I didn't stress you guys out or bore you, okay? But let me know what kind of content you do want to see in this apartment. Cause I'll be happy to give it to you. I just kind of need to know what the majority want. So if I see something a lot, then I'll definitely have to work on that for you guys. But thank you so much for watching and just thank you so much for everything you guys. Um, along with hard work, you guys are the reason that I'm here. Well, besides modeling, but you know, on this platform, y'all are the reason that I'm here. So I appreciate you guys. Every like, every comment, every little subscribe. I appreciate you guys but yeah i i'm like exhausted right now so i probably sound crazy but i will see you guys in the next episode moving part two let's pray that it goes better okay all right good night